A funeral service is being held in a church for a woman who had just passed away. At the end of the service, the pallbearer are carrying the casket out when they accidentally bump into a wall jarring the casket. They hear a faint moan. They open the casket and find that the woman is actually still alive. She lives for 10 more years and then dies. A ceremony is again held at the same church and at the end of the ceremony the pallbearers are again carrying out the casket. As they are walking, the husband cries out, Watch out for that wall! <laughs> What should you say if he asks you, am I your first? You might be, you look familiar. <laughs> A first grade teacher was overseeing her students as they experimented with their desk computers. One boy sat staring at the screen, unsure how to get the computer going. The teacher walked over and read what was on his screen. In her most reassuring voice, she said, The computer wants to know what your name is. Then she walked over to the next child. The boy leaned towards the screen and whispered, My name is David. <laughs> After a heavy night at the pub, a drunken man decided to sleep off his drunkenness at a local hotel. He approaches the reception desk, takes care of the formalities, and heads off to his suite. Several minutes later, the drunk stranger is back to the reception desk and demands his room to be changed. But sir, said the clerk, you have the best room in the hotel. I insist on another room, said the drunk. Very good, sir. I'll change you from 502 to 525. Would you mind telling me why you don't like 502? asked the clerk. Well, for one thing, said the drunk, it's on fire. <laughs> Little Johnny's kindergarten class was on a field trip to the local police station where they saw pictures tacked to a bulletin board of the 10 most wanted criminals. One of the youngsters pointed to a picture and asked if it really was the photo of a wanted person. Yes, said the policeman. The detective wants very badly to capture him. Little Johnny asked, why didn't you keep him when you took his picture? <laughs> A dog thinks, Hey, these people I live with feed me, love me, provide me with a nice, warm, dry house, pet me and take good care of me. They must be gods. A cat thinks, Hey, these people I live with Feed me, love me, provide me with a nice, warm, dry house, pet me, and take good care of me. I must be a god. <laughs> the doctor took Dan into the room and said, Dan, I have some good news and some bad news. Oh no, give me the good news first. They're going to name a disease after you. <laughs> a customer was bothering the waiter in a restaurant. First, he asked that the air conditioning be turned up because he was too hot. Then he asked it be turned down because he was too cold. And so on for about half an hour. Surprisingly, the waiter was very patient. He walked back and forth and never once got angry. So finally, a second customer asked him why he didn't throw out the pest. Oh, I really don't care or mind, said the waiter with a smile. We don't even have an air conditioner. <laughs> I haven't spoken to my wife for 18 months. I don't like to interrupt her. 
an old woman goes to the wizard to ask him if he can remove a curse she has been living with for the last 40 years. <laughs>